Hi, I'm Chris Neville. I'm the strength and conditioning coach at Portsmouth Football Club. Hi, my name is Ibrahim Asunko and you're watching 442 Performance. Resistance running produces power. In this case, we've combined resistance running with some technique work. You start with the band fully extended and the player leaning slightly forward. The player will then run towards you two to three yards to volley the ball back to you. In this case, we've used one right foot volley, one left foot volley and one header, although you can use different types of variations. We use two sets of six reps two to three times per week. Sometimes ball are playing to striker's feet, you know, they can be in the air, they can be on the floor and you've got to go pass in front of them to get the ball and they're not going to let you go that easy. Obviously they're going to try to hold you or to back up on into you, so stop you from there. So if you've got that strength going forward, you can always, you know, you know, make the move out of the way and literally then you've got to get the right technique. I mean, you know, being there strong, you know, push forward, then get the right technique and that's when the balance comes, you know, because you've done like so much resistance and suddenly like you're free, you know, then you have to adjust your feet and make sure you've got the right balance to make the right passing. You never know who you're going to play on Saturday and who's going to be at his best, you know, I mean, sometimes you get players, very good players, and you get them on a bad day, which is good for you, but when you get them on a bad day, on the, the best day, you have to be prepared for that. All the work you do, feet, balance, you know, strength, you know, coordination, being able to move from one way to another way with resistance, it's all good, it's part of the game, you know, I mean, they're so quick and so skillful, then, you know, when they change direction, you need to be reacting as fast as you can.